Hello, it is I, Dr. Brian Lorgan 111, and welcome back to Baba Is You. I've taken another look at Written in Stone, and I think I know how to solve it now. But there's something I don't understand, and that worries me. So I want you to witness something unusual. Suppose I say, uh, do I want to do this right now? Yeah. Text near flag is still. And then I put uh, some text near a flag, such as this text right here. And then, or the word Bob over there. And then say text is fall. All of that text falls. Okay, but some of you might say, well, the text falls because the text near flag is still. Rule is getting broken by it falling. And that actually is, is a thing. So, if I were to say, flag is push, and for example, grab this flag, and put it here, and then do this, and say text is fall, now the text near the flags doesn't fall because it's still. But this implies something weird about the behavior of fall, which is that after fall activates and text falls, then fall activates like again, and text falls under the new set of rules that got created under fall. If that makes any sense. Basically, it seems to me there's a multi-step evaluation order that doesn't fit into my usual mental model of how this game works. And that's worrisome. <laughs> um, because it's important to understand how this game works in order to be able to play the game. Also, uh, can I undo that? <laughs> I'm not sure how to undo that right now, so I will do this instead. Given that everything is behaving that way, that it seems that the solution to the whole puzzle, oops, is going to be just to do this. Say text near flag is still. Then say text is fall. There's a flag near win, so win won't fall. It says flag is win, and now I can go win the game on either of these two flags. Okay. So fall does something weird that I don't quite have an understanding of. Oh gosh, and there's a side puzzle. Words eroded by time. All right, well, let's check it out. Well, I've got this one burned into my brain. How does this puzzle, okay, there's a little bit of a different something right here. I wouldn't be able to push the flag in. How else does this puzzle differ? It also doesn't say text is text. It used to say text is text over here. So I could say text near Baba, is flag, for example, and make a bit of text go away, I think. Are those the only two differences? Those are the only two differences that my eye spots right now. So let's work under that assumption. So now I am able to change text, but otherwise have a very similar problem. But yeah, if I could say text near Baba is flag, then I could probably put a piece of, I can't get a piece of text here, can I? Um, let's see. Seems like I want to start the same way in order to be able to push text around more conveniently. I do want to say flag is a win at the end still. Previously I made win not fall by making that still. Can I say text near text? No, I don't have a second text keyword. So if I do this, win falls. So I need text near something is still, and I need it to be something that I can orient right over here. What can I get over there? Well, obviously Baba. However, Baba needs to be pushing this at the kind of correct moment.
Flag's not you. I said I could say text near something is flag. So if I could get some text in here, I could probably transform it into a flag. But I also don't see how to get any text in here. Is there another strategy that's available to me? Um... Hmm... What else could I do differently on this one? The other th thing that I was trying to do before was put something that's pushable down here just to support the word win. Um, but that has all the same problems that it had before. Okay, Brain. What else can we do here? And yeah, text is text. It's no longer here. Let's just triple verify that I'm remembering that correctly, that it used to say text is text, and now it doesn't, because that seems like a noteworthy change. On the left-hand side, text is defeat, text is text. Yep, that has changed. So, is text still defeat, and it's just not text? Text is defeat, but there's no longer text is text. So that seems to imply that I'm gonna turn a piece of text into a flag or into a baba. I could turn it into another baba. That's exactly what I need. Okay, solve the puzzle. With two actors, this should be super easy. So I need to say text near flag is baba, for example. So which piece of text do I not need any longer? Text near flag is Baba. Well, I need text near flag is, so it seems like it's got to be push. With a second Baba, I still have a problem because if Baba's not push, something, something dark side. But then I could say Baba near something is flag. Yeah, I'll be able to say Baba near text is flag and then fix it. And that's how I get it. Okay. Yep. Okay. So we have all the ingredients we need. So text near flag is Baba. Uh, and I'm going to use the word, uh, oops, uh, push. So that will be the only text that's near a flag. It's going to turn into a second Baba. Great. Then I want to say Baba near text is flag. Ooh. But that will kill the Baba who's activating the rule or turn him into a flag. I could have said Baba near flag. I can't get the flag over here. So again, the idea is that we want a Baba there, who's gonna be able to support the falling text, um, but that requires the Baba being pushable. Could I reuse the is? Mm, I don't think so. Oh, but I could say Baba is still. Uh, or Baba near text is still. Mm. If I say Baba is still, I won't be able to move. So it'd have to be Baba near something, but I can't even do that. Because Baba's U is trapped in the column that it's currently in. But I could say text near Baba is still, but that means that I wouldn't be able to push the word fall. I would still need pushable flags. Okay, I feel like, was there a word other than push that I could have transformed into a Baba? Somehow? Right now I don't see another one that I could do. This does feel like a portion of the answer to the puzzle. And so, Baba near something is text. That would do it. Baba near flag is text. 
but then I would have to have a flag in here. I could have the flag just sitting right here, and then Baba could be trapped in here. Yeah, if there had been a flag here, and the word push was here, Baba would have been created down here. Or even if he's not created down here, yeah, yeah, yeah. I could turn him into text in this location right here, and then this Baba could push it to the left. And... Then what? That still doesn't quite work. <laughs> but it's definitely closer. So here's what we're gonna do. We are going to... Push one of the flags down here. Where do I want it exactly? Where do I want it exactly? I'm not certain. I'm going to put it there for now. Then I need to do my text near flag is Baba. And I'm still transforming push, and I can always walk Baba in there, so it doesn't matter where I do this. Okay, so there's my second Baba. One of you guys is gonna go sit in here in a little bit. But I need to say Baba near flag is text at the right moment. Okay. Oops, I just pushed win. Uh, that's no good. Baba, why don't you get out of that little box for right now, and we'll put you back in the box at the last possible moment. Okay, Baba near flag is... text. Okay, so now I need Baba to go get trapped over in that corner. And actually, it'd be better if the word text were coming from below, and I can push upwards, I think, for reasons. So let's do... Uh, how did it get that far? Whatever. Ah, uh, whatever. I can stretch you guys out. Okay. So, I want to go here. Yeah, this feels good. So, Bob and your flag is text. There we go. I've got a word. And why did I want this? I was thinking I would be able to, like, push this in. Oops. I would be able to push that in now and get it supporting win somehow or something, but that's not the case. So instead, if I have a second word Baba, can I do something with Baba and still? Let's back up to when we just made this. I need to move to the left to activate text as fall. I can also move to the left in here. But can I activate Baba is still at the same moment? No. But with the second Baba keyword... With the second Baba keyword. I can do something, it feels like. What can I do? Let's actually get the second Baba keyword. And this time, this time let's get it outside. Uh, so yeah, you hang out up there. I will hang out down here, and now you need to go, like, a bunch of steps to the right, so we do like that. Uh, and then you need to go... slightly higher, I think. There we go. Okay, so I got a second Baba keyword. What do I do with it? 
Baba near flag is still? Yes. Except it would require having a flag down here. Baba near text is flag. Except, right, the creation of that rule requires that the activator gets killed. I was trying to have Baba get near this text and turn into a flag. Um, flag near Baba is Baba. Flag near Baba is Baba. Could turn one of these back into a Baba. Flag near Baba is Baba. So I could get a Baba back. So yeah, let's actually, I feel like I'm taking the long way around to get to a solution, but I just need to experiment with these words. I'm having a hard time visualizing in my brain and an easier time visualizing on the screen. So, oh, flag's flag, right, can't do that. Okay. I can transform text into a flag. I can transform text into a Baba. What do I need in the end game? In the end game, I either need a Baba here who is push, a flag here who is push, or a piece of text here. I know how to transform Baba into a piece of text, but only when he is near a flag. I can't push a flag into this region. I was able to finagle a flag over to here, but once I had transformed something into a flag, it could not be transformed back because flag is flag. So do I think it's going to be Baba who's pushable, or do I think it's going to be text, or it could be Baba is still. Yeah, because I still haven't used still here. So could it be Baba? Baba near text is still, right? That's what I was... Baba near text is still... Ooh, can I just do that from the beginning somehow? If I had two Babas and one of the flags was still pushable, the other Baba could be still or something, I think. So yeah, two Babas. One of them pushes a flag to create the words Baba near text is still. And so he doesn't become still. The other one push text is fall. Oh, but that's Baba's still. I need the other one to be... Right, so I need to push a flag. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So the idea would be I would be pushing from here with one Baba. He would still be movable. The other Baba would be sitting here. He would become still because he's near text. And that's how we win the game. So that's the idea. So I just need a second Baba. And I can do that by saying text near flag is Baba. And then once again, I don't need the push keyword. And so the push keyword is going to be the keyword that's going to die. Okay, so text near flag is Baba. Text near flag is Baba. There's our... Oh. There's another piece of text near flag. I kind of need that one. <laughs> so I shouldn't have pushed the flag all the way there? Hmm. But then how am I going to push? Oh, and how am I going to push with the flag if I get rid of push? It seems so good. Until it wasn't. I need pushable flags at the end. If I had another Baba keyword, I could sacrifice is because I could say text near flag and reuse this is and put the other Baba keyword here. So what if I do... Uh, 
First off, I'm pretty sure I'm going to need to move this flag back out, so let's back up to where I moved that flag in really quick. There we go. Okay. Uh, this flag is out in the world, free and clear. Okay, so now I'm thinking... Bob and your flag is text. Oh, but I, I need two babas to do that, which means converting one of my bits of text. And I can't convert the is. But yeah, I definitely would need the word Baba again. I keep running around in circles. Is there some other way for Baba to push text to do this move that doesn't involve him being near text? Because I really want Baba near text is still. I would need some other pushable thing. The only other pushable thing is text, or a pushable flag, or a pushable baba, or something like that. Okay, so if that's not the solution, then the other solution would be baba is push. One baba's here. Okay, why doesn't this one work? And the other baba's here. So just create two babas and then say baba is push. And if I'm going to create two babas and then say baba is push then it could be well again the problem is in order to say text near something is baba the only something that i have available is flag and then the only text that's remaining is push no i could use the word text yeah i could use the word text So if I do this, here we go. I don't need the word text anymore, right? Because now I'm just going to say Baba's push. Great. I've got two Babas. I still have his push. Now I can say Baba is push. Baba becomes pushable. He will be able to support the falling text. And the puzzle is solved. Right? Right. Um, I need a different offset. You guys come in line. Uh, nope, I need even more. Uh, that's the wrong way. There we go. So now if I take a step to the left, text will become fall. Flag is win will fall on top of... Ba oh. Baba's push, but... <laughs> text falls. <laughs> and so Baba is push. The rule falls. And Baba's push gets broken, and wind falls on top of Baba and crashes him. So this is the same thing that I was having trouble understanding in the previous puzzle. Okay. How do I solve that? It was such a good idea. I don't have enough other pushables to keep it from falling. However, a thing occurred to me, which is, at this moment, I transformed text into a baba but I don't need the words near or flag anymore either so I think now what I actually want to do is have the flag here and create three babas it sounds crazy it is crazy but sometimes crazy is just what we need. Baba is... Push. I could have done that more effectively. All right. So now we have pushable Babas. So I need... I need one Baba 
under the word win. I need one Baba pushing the word fall. And then I need two Babas who are gonna hold on to the text Baba is push. <laughs> Did you get all that? Also, it'll be easier. Will it be easier? I don't know if it'll be easier. I'm gonna do this anyway. I think it'll be easier if this is already quote unquote fallen. Okay. So, two Babas on the right have to be next to each other like this. Uh, then they're gonna have to squeeze in there. Uh, I kind of messed this up, it's fine. So my right two babas are gonna be over there. At the same time that my left two babas have just made the left text that they're doing, I don't have enough. There's not enough squeezy, pushy kind of stuff to make that work. Um, this was a good idea, I think, still. I'm just missing something still. Hopefully it's not the word still. Were these guys ever far enough apart before I started squeezing them together? Or are they... Oh, I could have squeezed them. Or unsqueezed them. Like, I can get a whole lot of distance over here like this. There we go. Okay, I think this might be kind of what I need. So. You're down here. Uh, we're going to need to make an upward move. So these guys on the right need to move down once more. This guy needs to move over to the left. Then I can make the upward move. Left. There needs to be another left, which means that these two guys are not in sync properly. So I need to make the... There we go. So from here, down, left, uh, that wasn't quite right, but uh, getting closer. <laughs> um, I need the is push guys to be ready to go. So they need to move. Okay, got it. How am I going to move the is push guys a couple over to the left? And the answer is like this. Just like that. Okay. So... Down. Uh, now the is push guys are too low. The next left move is almost correct. But the right two babas are too low. So I need the right two babas to be higher, which I can do right here. Uh, but then this happens. So I need an upward move. Can I do something like this and then get my upward move here? Yes. And now leftward move. I think this is going to solve the puzzle. Flags win. However, text is always going to be falling. Uh, this happens to work out because I can just move upwards. <laughs> no, because then I break Baba's push. <laughs> so all of this would work except for I need a flag in one of the four Baba positions right now. So back when I could push a flag, I should push it down to just to the right of Baba is you. Okay, I have a solution. 
There might be a better solution, but I definitely can see a solution. Uh, none of these flag positions were particularly meaningful, so I just need to back up to when we had flag as push. Actually, one of the flag positions was me meaningful. Um, so we're going to leave the bottom flag, but we're going to push this flag down to right here, and that's going to be the place where we're going to win. And then everything else is going to be fine and dandy. Um, yes, great. Okay. Baba is push. Uh, let's get push over here as well. All right, Baba's push. Then we peel off two guys to be the right-hand guys. We get two guys to be the left-hand guys. We get the right-hand guys down on the same column or whatever. We start getting the left-hand guys roughly into position. And then we do our various adjustments, uh, which are A, I forgot to push all this stuff down. <laughs> So we'll kind of readjust everything in a minute. Okay, that's all been pushed down. Great. And then I need these guys spread out as far apart as possible. Okay, great. And then now from here, these guys do want to be at different heights. And then we just walk them back in very carefully over here. Um, left, up. And I want to make two more left moves, and so the guys over to the right need to be farther over. Uh, I just disrupted push, but I can put it back after I move, oops, after I move them over, which means moving this guy over and also moving the other guy over. Uh, now they've both been moved too far, hold on. All right, disrupting push is a bad idea. Let's back up from here. So I want to make fewer leftward moves against leverage here. This is very similar to what I just did. The problem is you, got it. So if I go up, left, down, left except for these guys are too low, so I need them to be higher. If I go right, left, you'll be in position now to where I can move up. There we go. And now left. There we go. This is going to solve the puzzle, literally. When I press to the left, text will be fall, Baba will be push, flag will be win, and the third of the four Babas reading left to right will be standing on a flag. Did it. Easy game. I have a feeling there was probably another solution that involved the word still. But I did not find that solution. I found my solution, and I'm very happy with it. Hooray! I did also take a look at this puzzle again, anti-gravity. I still do not know what the heck is going on in this puzzle. It's kind of the long and the short of it. Like, I did some things off camera, and they're, they're not making progress. So that's going to be another one that we're going to have to return to on another day. And I think it's a little bit too late to start a new puzzle today. So I'm going to say that I hope, as always, that you all are having a great day. And I will see you again soon with more Baba is You. For now, bye-bye.